morning guys, we're out again. We're out again, yes. Uh, bit of a dull day, but, but yeah. we've got something a little different for the video. Ooh, a, surprise! A big surprise, yeah. And wow, 500 subscribers. <laughs> yeah, the big wow. five double O. Wow. How's it happened? Because everybody like you loves us. Uh, a big thank you to to all of you. Yeah. Uh, thanks for coming along Can't watching our videos. Enough. Right, we'll be doing a live stream, not this Sunday, it'll be the Sunday after. The big 500 giveaway. Uh, we're doing a big 500 giveaway, big live event. Uh, some good things up for grabs. Yeah, some cracking prizes up for grabs. So, yeah, we'll just go and get on this hunt and we'll catch you. And it'll be a bit hour. earlier too, it'll be about yeah, half past five. It'll be about half five UK time. Unfortunately, some of the big prizes are only UK based only. Uh, yeah, there's nothing we can do about that. Because they're, they're going to cost quite a bit to post, so. Unfortunately, sorry to all you guys who. Yeah, I am, Rick knows the score. Over the waters. Uh, the smaller prizes, yeah, we can post to you, but the big uh, 500 prize is UK, UK based, only. Unfortunately. UK only, so. On that note, we catch you on the next hole. Bye for now. Catch you later. Hello boys and girls. I've got finally got a target and it's a bit of doggy bling. <laughs> hey. I've not got a clue. Well a dog to tag or something. But a bit of doggy bling. Cool. Catch you on the next one. Right boys and girls, where Paul filled his hole in, uh, he's just had a target. <laughs> and it's this. Which is an old buckle. Uh, very rusty. It was about what, about seven, eight inches down. Yeah, it was deep. So it was really deep. <coughs> but yeah, buckle. I'll catch you on the next one. A buckle from the depths. Hi right, guys, as you can tell, Paul's over there. I'm under this uh, little bandstand. Very pissing down. Unfortunately, uh, I'll show you a bit of kit, a new kit we got, something interesting that uh, maybe you might like us see us do. This little camera, uh, kit vision. It's the same uh, make what we use our camera, what we camera we're using, but you've got two lenses on it. You know what that means, don't you? You guys can see us in VR. 360 degrees. Go at a bargain price. Uh, so if you want to see some VR or 360 degree video of both metal detecting, uh, I will make some videos. So what do you reckon guys? Uh, I've tried it out and it's pretty cool. You can rather see us in VR mode. So you can have a headset, if you've got a VR headset, uh, you can plug your phone in, put the video on and move around. Or you can just swipe the screen on YouTube. And that will be your 360 degrees. So I'm going to do a little clip in a bit. Show you what things we can do. Alright, catch you in a little bit. Early late 17, early 1800s this part. Right boys and girls. Mr Paul Edwards. Has got a coin. Finally. And get a coin. Solid 73, 75. And that's on the AT Max. There it is. There we go. Oh, there we go. See you guys. See what we've got. It's a Georgie board, and we'll do it on the old kitchen pant. Oh. Get the old rub. Let me just take my gloves off, guys. Definitely a George, that. Definitely a George. 
he finally made an appearance. It's not a bad nick neither. Oh, we'll definitely get a date off that. I think it's 1949, James. That's it. No, you're not. 1930, mate. Oh, 1930. 1930. And I've got glasses on. That's pretty nice, that fella. I found a little button. And he's found a little button as well. Very cool. Well done, mate. Catch you on the next. I'll just try you. Yeah, I'll just try you all again. Yeah, that's it. Well done, mate. Cheers, mate. Catch on, next. Well, my fellow flood flabs. Chubberino has got something. What can it be? Right what there. can it be? Oh, look at that there. That is a monster. Isn't it? It is. That is a big coin. As he cleans it on the old tree bark. Uh, I can't really tell. Never look at it. Yeah. I can't really tell. Try to get a bit of on your pants. And yours here. The old Tesco trolleys. Let's go. Something there. It's a Vicky, I think. Cool. Sorry for scraping it, guys. It's a bit toasted, guys. Well, we think it's a Vicky. Yeah, we think it's a Vicky. You might get a date off there. On to the next. Right, boys and girls, that's me hole, and we have another coin. I'll take it out and get it to Paul. I think that's a 50p. Well, it looks like a 50p, doesn't it? It's certainly is, James, it's a spendable. A spendy. A 50 pence piece. A 50 pence piece. Who's it got up back? Oh. oh. Britannia. Britannia on the back. Cool. Cool. It's another coin. Spend it. Spend it. Spend it. Right, boys and girls, uh, to fill me all in, went over the target again. And we got a 20 pence piece. More spendies. 20 pence piece. Paul's there, he's got a tag as you can see. He's just there and watch him. See what you get. Is it deep, Paul? I'll go over and I'll go over and see him. It's it. Well, it looks like that's like a button. It's on a little button. It is a little button. A little button. Thanks. Hey, thanks for on it as well. Oh, that's it. No, no. it's gone. Little bot, 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 Catch you on next. Right, boys and girls, just on your paw. And Big we... Jim Bob McClaskey. Done it again. Done it again. We got a coin in the hole. It's a lizzy. It. And it's a ten pence piece. Oh, Bendies. sixty pence spendable. Yeah, sixty. No, son, uh, eighty. Eighty pence. Eight oh, pence eh? Bendies. 
Oh, every bit goes to your car. It does, it does, go. I need to get my car fixed. It certainly does. Anyway, guys. I need 600 pounds to get my car fixed. On to the 10 pence next. Yep, bye for now. Right, boys and girls, I've got another target and it's another 50 pence piece because I've lost it now. Where is it? There we go. Yep. It was very, very wet, wet and muddy today. Getting it all over my hands. Yep, just a 50 pence piece. Cool. There's Lizzie on the back. And it's the well, remember it's one. I uh, don't know the name of it. But yeah, 50p. Catch you on next. Hi right, boys and girls, I just about threw my hole in uh, and I went over it again just in case. And it was, it's another 20p. Alright, catch you on the next one. Well, I'll catch you in a little minute. Paul's got silver in his hole. So we'll have a walk over and I better just throw my hole in. Always remember, throw your holes in. Make it look better than it did before you dug it out. It's the only tip I can give you. You fill your holes in. Right, we'll just nip holes for Paul. Through all these bushes and trees. And he said he's got silver. Does it look like it, doesn't it? It certainly does. Now we'll go in and have a proper I've not even touched it on it, dug it up. Right, go on James, I'll give you the almonds. And it certainly is. 1931. Well done mate. Well that's light. Who like that? It's like that isn't it? Mm. It's a Georgie Porge, yeah? Yeah, it's definitely a Georgie Porge, yeah. And they, like said, yep, 1931. It'll clean up lovely that. Be half and half that one at 31. Half and half, yeah, I think so. Let's just check this all again, yeah, James. Yeah, just check it all, mate. There we go. Right, we've got something there, lads, so... I'm going to show. I'll hold that for you, mate. Right, we'll get back to you when we dug it out. Doctor, we have a heartbeat. We certainly do. In there somewhere. Certainly in there, mate. Out. Oh, somewhere there. Yeah, I can see it. Oh, a piece of shit. <laughs> Let's get it out. Is a coin. That is a farthing being cut. No, yeah, then. It's a farthing, but it's been uh, hammered. Cut. It's 
Try it again. Go. There you go. Follow the scroll over it again. Yeah, just farthing. Uh, still a nice bit of coin. Right, that's it, that's it. Yep, that's that's it. it. Right, we'll catch you on the next one, guys. Right, guys, we just had a, I didn't realise. It's a crop piece of threatening bit. A threatening bit. You just see tassels up back. Yeah, I don't really know my old coins. Threatening bit. Yep, cool. What do you say, Paul? Right, minute. boys and girls, uh, Paul's got a target. We've been at it for about five minutes. And uh, it's a coin. It was right under that root. I'll just do a quick wipe. The uh, silver was just there. And it, the coins was just under that root. We've been here for about five minutes. Try and get to dig it out. You know, I'll rub on the old pump it. You can see what you hit for. It's a Georgie Porgy. It's a Georgie Porgy. Can we get a date? Oh, it's, it's a little bit warm. I don't know. No, I'm not going to get there on that one. But it certainly is George. Yep, see him there. Well done, mate. We know he's clean. Alright, boys and girls, we'll catch you on the next one. Alright, guys, Paul's got a target. It's that, it's there. Oh, it's yeah. a coin. It's a coin. There we go. Right there, see you guys. That ball, get it out and see what we got. An oldie. It's definitely an oldie. On the old pants again. I didn't take your gloves off. Have a proper look. If anyone can recommend some decent gloves, uh, please leave a comment below. I don't think it's there, Tony James. Oh, no. no, it's a bit toasted. Oh, we might, we might get some on that end. We'll have a proper look when I get home. Yeah, we'll have a proper look when he gets home. Right, catch you on the next one. And something had already dug here, a dog or something. And it must have brought it out. Right, we'll catch you on the next one. Well, boys and girls, literally, from there, where I am, to here. And it looks like a little penny. A little half pence. Yeah, it's only an half pence. They don't make them anymore, guys. No. Uh, let's see if I can get a date. Give me eyes focus. Ooh. You'd be lucky. Just check that area again there, James. Yeah, I think Jamie just sent it. I signalled that for half a P. No, that was definitely with it, mate. Well, there you go, guys. Jim, the half a P king. See, can I get a date? It'd be nice to get a date. Be 70s. Might be 60s, that. Nineteen seventy-nine. Yeah, nineteen seventy-nine. I, I was born in seventy-six. Wait, it's not that old. I was born in sixty-nine. <laughs> well, if you bought all the same age as him, I'll tell you what, Paul. There you go. It's your age. It's your coin. There we go, guys. What a gentleman. Tight.
<laughs> Can't pull that in it. On to the next. Can't pull that in it. Oh, right guys, Paul's got a target. Uh, he's got a coin. Uh, it's been chopped. Not by Paul. Oh, don't leave George. Well that proves one thing. That's this used to be grass. Yeah. Because that's been cut with mower. Yeah. Hasn't it? Well, that's it, yeah. So on to that, James. Yeah, that looks... I might get a wet date as well, mate. I'm just doing old rub. Uh, oh, look at that. Where the date's gone? They cut the date off. <laughs> but yeah, it's down there, George. It's a penny. Well, right, we'll just take you over to me. I'm over there. Well, I got a coin as well. Yep. I'll let Paul do the honours. <coughs> I'll do the honours, mate. Just right there. Oh, lovely. Yeah. Oh, it's a small one. P one. Oh, it's a George. It's a George Apology. Yeah, it's just half penny. Half penny. Sure, Paul's got a target and he's got a button. Oh, there you might oh. not be a button. Oh, well, well. Might not be a button. Give us your cloth. Your cloth. Uh, that's it. There you go, mate. It is a button. It's got an anchor on it. I can't. But there's nothing at the back. There's only writing on the back. And it's lead. Feel how heavy that is. Wow. Right. Right, have a look at that, guys. They wouldn't use lead as buttons, would they? Uh, there's no shank or anything on the back. Does it look like a two piece? It's made out of lead. Uh, if anyone knows, please leave a comment below. Uh, that's very interesting. It's an anchor, isn't it? It's only an anchor with like an eight round it, rope round it. It's definitely lead, but it's heavy. Yeah, it's definitely lead. You got spit and polish? I haven't. No, I haven't. Right, not. No spit and polish today, guys. Forgot to pick it up. We're just travelling light today, won't we? Yeah. But yeah, it's definitely lead and it's old. But yeah, it looks like an anchor with something going through it. I'll take a picture of it later on. And I'm gonna let on. you know, yeah. Alright, catch you on the next. Nice find. So, right boys and girls, uh, this is my target uh, for Paul to get out for me. I've been trying for the last 10 minutes to try and get it out. Uh, you want to get it out, Paul? There we go. And it's definitely a coin. It's still in the same hole from the last one. You want to try and clean it up, Paul, please, mate? Yeah, just give it a sec. Uh, I was going to try and give it a clean and let us know what it is. Cheers for getting that out, mate. No worries, bud. It's a smoothie. It is a bit of a smoothie, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. It's only a half penny. That was a little coin spill in that hole. Going be somebody a, there. It's going to be a George, ain't it? Could be a Victoria. Yeah. There's somebody there. There's oh, someone there, but we can't actually get the ID. But yep. Yeah. Well, guys, my last coin and James's coin was there, and my coin was just there. 
and we've come to here. We have another one. We have another. Yeah, a bit battered these coins. Yeah. It's an Edward. Well. I'm definitely sure that's Edward. I'll tell you what guys, we'll give it a clean when we get back to the car. I've got one. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure it's an Edward. Well, my little siblings. If anybody knows what that is. I'm not looking at that. Look like a dog. It's definitely a coin. It's definitely a coin. Mm. Let's give it a wipe on the pants of shame. It's a Georgie Pod, yeah? Alright, it's a George. See if we get a date. See if we can get a date. Have you got that cloth, James? I certainly have. Let's move my gloves out of the way. We might get a date off this, James. Alright, cool. Always good to get dates. Seems happy. It's a Georgie Porgy. It's a Georgie Porgy. Pudding and pie. I think it's 1919. No, that's 13? Oh, 19, 13. Cool. Well done, mate. Another one in the pot. The next. On to the next. Right, boys and girls, show you what we've got. Uh, I've got a penny, two 20 pences, 10 pence, two 50 p's. These are all coins. That's a penny and two half pennies. Uh, a bit of doggy bling, which is a dog's bone. I'll show you what Paul's got. He's got two pennies. Uh, we think one's is a Edward, we're not sure. Uh, you got one, two, three, four, five half pence. Two threatening bits. There's that half pea found. I'll give it to Paul. He's found a button. Ten pence. A bit of a threatening bit. A key. A whatever that is. He found this, which is very, very interested. interesting. It's an anchor. It's made out of lead. There's nowhere for a shank on the back. Uh, if anyone knows, please leave a comment below. Uh, and the star of the show, it's got to be this silver. It's George, and it's a sixpence. 1931, so it's be probably half silver. But yeah, cool. What a day. What are you looking for? Another fine and dandy, wet and miserable day. But, proofs in the pudding. Uh, definitely this place hasn't been detected, has it? No. No, definitely not. For what we've found. So yeah, it's our kept little secret. So it's not been too bad. Uh, don't forget we're doing a live stream on the... A week on Sunday. The 17th. We'll be live at half past five. The 17th of this month. We're definitely. Doing. Especially UK. Definitely be watching because there's a first prize for our 500 giveaway. I'm telling yeah. you, 
there's not many out there. There's not many out there, so yeah. Uh, Done by a complete professional. Uh, if you might know him, Steve Pettikin. Big shout out. Yeah, yeah. Put his uh, channel in the link below. He's the master. Yeah, so on the 17th, uh, live stream. Sunday big, night. Sunday night. Half big, past five. Yeah, half past five. Big 500 giveaway. giveaway. Yeah, there's a lot. Of, there's, a, there's a, a bit of stuff and there's some bloody good stuff. Yeah. Not like they'll open the box, there's not been millions of prizes, but what we'll, prizes we're giving away. We'll be doing open the box. We we'll open the box. Oh. It will be here, it will be there. We uh, might just pick it out of a bucket. I've got to do something special for Kimmy, Dirt Diggers UK. Uh, I thought we were going to do something special on the live stream. Because oh, yeah. we love it so much. Oh, yeah. We'll do something a little special for you. Don't get jealous, Scott. Yeah. We love to a bit. <laughs> Right guys, we'll catch you on the next one. Bye for now. Bye for now. See you later guys.